G'day trendsetters and bedwetters, it's the old goose shooter here from Geraldine. Well it's that time of the year for the new year new me bullshit. Don't hope for that better year, create a better year. So everyone goes out and you know makes those new year's resolutions. So if I went out and said right, my new year's resolution is to not buy any more junk and crap that I don't need, well... I kind of would have stuffed that up on day one when I brought that header. Last year I survived. This year I want to live. But my question to you is, why do we have to wait until a new year to make changes? Why can't it be July, October, or even a Wednesday to make those changes? The same water that softens a potato hardens an egg. It's about what you're made of, not the circumstances. If you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. When you focus on you, you grow. When you focus on shit, shit grows. At the end of the day, you don't have to be in control of your thoughts. You've just got to stop letting your thoughts control you. Last year, I lost, I won, I cried, I failed, I laughed, and I cried some more but I did not fold. Sometimes the best laid plans fall apart. And at the end of the day, we're all like a Kenworth. We get old, we get tired, we get slow, and we break, break down. It's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when. Saying you don't have a mental health issue is a lot like saying you don't have medical issues. Even the healthiest person gets a cold from time to time. Mental health works that same way. We all face the challenges in life that impact our mental health. Everyone has mental health and everyone's mental health matters. You're not lost, you're learning who you are. You are still here growing and changing. You can't go back and change the beginning, but you can start where you are and change the ending. Stop being ashamed of how many times you've fallen and start being proud of how many times you've got up. Don't be afraid to start over. You're not starting from scratch. You're starting from experience. I mean, at the end of the day, if I waited till I had all my ducks in a row, I'd never cross the street. Sometimes you have to gather up what you got and make a run for it. You don't have to see the whole staircase to take that first step. Just because I give you advice doesn't mean I'm smarter than you. It basically means I've done more dumb shit and I've lived to tell the tale. I don't regret the things that I've done I regret the things that I didn't do when I had the chance. So if you're out there and you've got the slightest chance of getting something that will make you happy, risk it. Life is short and happiness is rare. Sometimes I want to give up and then I remember I've got people to prove wrong. And when you prove people wrong, you're going to piss a lot of people off when you start doing what's best for you. But remember, you're not here to fit in their world. You're here to make your own world. Just because it doesn't happen right away, doesn't mean it won't happen for you. And just because you could yesterday, doesn't mean you can today. Just because you can't today, doesn't mean you won't be able to tomorrow. When life gives you a hundred reasons to break down and cry, show life that you have a thousand reasons to smile and laugh. Every day might not be good, but there was always some good in every day. All I'm asking is don't give up. Don't count yourself out. Don't feed that negative thought and fear that might pop up to make you doubt yourself. Just remember, planes take off against the wind, not with it. Keep believing, keep trusting, keep going. Your time is coming. If you're serious about changing your life, you will find a way. If you're not, you will find an excuse. But anyway, I'm going to carry on. You have a good one. Talk to you later. Cheers, Robbie, over and out. Woohee!